kama Tif TV. Tif TV tupo kijamii zaidi. Dr. Chacha, uh, thank you very much for the hospitality shown and to the people of Tanzania in particular Zanzibar. I arrived here on Saturday and it's like I'm home. So I'm really happy to be here. Now, as Saba, we are an organization that caters for public broadcasting within the Sadek region. And many of us as public broadcasters, we, we sit where our job really is to inform, educate and entertain our different respective countries. And it's quite an interesting job at the best of times, very difficult because everybody who watches our channels, they have a say in what we do. And that's simply because we are funded through funds that are coming from the public via our respective governments. Now, we have been moving to set up a, a television Saba channel, which has been a process that has been in making for a couple of years. But where we are now in terms of progress, we currently have a 30 minutes long news uh, television uh, program called Eye on Sadek, which is been throughout the whole of, of Sadek. And in particular here, I need to commend Dr. Chacha because their version of Eye on Sadek, they are translating it 100% into Kiswahili, which is a very, very good thing because that embeds making sure that people fully understand what is happening there. And then on the radio side, we also have a similar program called Sadek 360, which is running from Maseru uh, in Lesotho. It's dealing exactly the same, but it's more for radio audiences. Maybe Dr. Chacha, at this point, let me just give you, just to do a translation for this. Okay, Asante Sana Kwa Kifupi. Rais wa saba anasema eh, sisi kama vyombo vya habari vya umma tumekuwa tukikutana kwa sababu tunajadili masuala ambayo yana umuhimu eh, kwa maisha ya watu wetu tunahabarisha tunaelimisha tunaburudisha na kwamba tunafanya hivyo kwa tukiwa na wajibu mkubwa kwa sababu tunaendeshwa kwa fedha za umma eh, ambazo zinapitia kwenye ruzuku ya serikali Lakini amesema kati ya kipindi ambacho tumekuwa tukikutana tumepanga masuala muhimu ikiwemo e, kuanzisha tunampanga kuanzisha television vyombo vyetu vya habari e, na mpango huo umesogea mbali kwa sasa tunavyozungumza na tayari tuna kipindi cha dakika 30 katika vyombo vyetu vyote vya e, huu kanda wa Sadek e, kipindi cha dakika 30 kinaitwa I on Sadek yani jicho letu katika hii jumuiya ya Sadek. Na kimekuwa kinatafsiriwa katika lugha mbalimbali kutegemea huko nchi gani. Sisi Tanzania ukiangalia TBC utakiona kiko kwa lugha ya Kiswahili. Ingawa katika nchi zingine kinakuwa katika lugha za kule. Lakini amemalizia pia kwamba tunayo redio iko Maseru. Yaani tunatangazia kutokea Maseru ambapo watu wote wa Sadek kule Lesotho Nchi zote sadek wanapeleka kule inaandaliwa zinaruka na ni vipindi ambavyo na sisi e, kama TBC tayari tumeshajiandaa kuanza kurusha kwa lugha ya Kiswahili. Thank you Dr. Chacha. So very soon we hoping to have a full Saba television channel that will showcase programs comprised of what the region can offer. And hopefully through that we can influence the continent and the globe in terms of who and what we are. And the beauty about Saba is that, for instance, in Namibia, we would only be getting stories from Tanzania through the BBCs, the Skies, and the CNNs. But then their version of those stories would not reflect exactly what was happening. The major, major advantage we are having today is that we are getting these stories directly from the broadcasters. So they can tell the stories in the way that they feel. And for us as Africans, that is quite a very, very, very commendable step in that regard. We are also meeting here today to also show our support for our sister broadcaster and also to show the people of Tanzania that as Saba, 
we are not just concentrated in one block. So our meetings are held in all the countries and these are decisions that we take as we see. Like today we will be having a board meeting where we will also then decide where the next Saba conference board meeting will be. So in that way we make sure that all the countries get a chance to be hosting these this, this kinds of events. Now, what is also important is that as we are holding the board meetings, we also have broadcast conferences where we talk about things, about innovation, about technology, about training, so that we can at all times make sure that our staff, the people that work for us and us leading, so that we can get them to upskill their levels of understanding. And as you know today, the smartphone is everything. So many of us have already moved into that the direction where people now can watch our programs on the smartphone as well. So it's that type of innovation, it's that type of, of making sure that we remain at the cutting edge that we will also be concentrating on to make sure that as, as, as a body that Saba does add value to what is happening within the globe. Hivi uh, karibuni, Eh, tutaanzisha television yetu eh, kama ilivyosema awali television kabisa ambayo itakuwa inarusha matangazo yenye maudhui yaliyoandaliwa na sisi wa Afrika wenyewe katika nchi zetu na kwamba hiyo itakuwa ni mfano kwa maeneo mengine eh, ya Afrika na duniani kwamba upo muhimu wa sisi kuwa na eh, vyombo vyetu vya habari ili tuandike habari zetu kwa mtazamo wetu na anasema katika miaka mingi ilikuwa unakuta chombo cha, cha utangazaji cha umma cha Namibia wanapata habari za Tanzania kupitia BBC eh, Voice of America au CNN na wengine eh, na kwamba hili sisa hii sasa hii television tunayoanzisha na radio na actually tutakuwa mtandaoni kwa sababu ya teknolojia manake ni kwamba tutakuwa tunapata maudhui ambayo yameandaliwa na waafrika wenyewe kutoka Msumbiji, kutoka Angola, kutoka Afrika Kusini, kutoka Lesotho, kutoka Eswatini na na kwingine na kwingine. Na anasema katika mikutano hii ambayo huwa tunakutana e, huwa tunajadili masuala mbalimbali yanayohusu taaluma ikiwemo e, ubunifu a, ikiwemo E, mafunzo kwa watu wetu kwa sababu teknolojia inabadilika sana tunahitaji mafunzo ya mara kwa mara e, lakini huwa tunajadili masuala muhimu yanayohusu e, ni namna gani e, sekta inabadilika na sisi tuwe tayari katika mabadiliko hayo ili tuendelee e, kubakia na maana yani tuwe na maana katika jamii ambazo tunazihudumia and then uh, second to last uh, part of what we will be discussing is also the issue of sports rights we find that at this part of the world we struggle to get the best of what sports can offer and that is simply because the big entities that are commercial in nature where people must pay close to maybe a, a, a hundred you a hundred us dollars per month for subscriptions they buy these rights and they make it difficult for us who are not necessarily uh, commercial. So we will also be focusing on that to see what type of strategies can we put in place because we believe that as a block, our, our sum total of who we are does make us strong and it can make a case for us to be able to approach these big federations and tell them that, look, this is where we are, this is what we want and we would want special packages tailored for our needs as well, based on the sports that our respective countries would, would, would want. And then in closing, I, I really just want to thank you again, Dr. Chacha, for really, and your team, and the government, and uh, because when I came in on Saturday, I was, I was so tired, but the, the receipts that I got were so great that I just found myself <laughs> being awake. And I was lucky because at the airport, I also met the mayor of okay. Zanzibar. So we were in the plane but we didn't know each other but when we disembarked so we could we could share a few words as well. So that African spirit of accepting us for who we are is what makes us really feel that we belong. So we are looking forward for a very uh, intense 
and yet uh, beautiful week. And we're hoping to brief you as well once we're done with the full week in terms of what we've achieved. Thank you very much. Sante na jambo lingine ambalo tutazungumza katika mkutano huu ni swala zima la haki za eh, hii michezo ya kimataifa ya soka kwa mfano. Eh, kwamba haki hizi mara nyingi zimekuwa zinauzwa kibiashara na unakuta sisi ambao tuko kwenye vyombo vya umma tena ambavyo vina eh, kimiundo mbinu vinawafikia watu wengi zaidi kuliko vyombo vingine bado tunakuwa tunapata eh, eh, kazi kubwa kwa kweli kupata haki zile kwa sababu bei zinakuwa ziko juu mno lakini tunaamini kwamba katika mazungumzo tunayoendelea nayo e, tutafikia pahala ambapo e, na wahusika wataona umuhimu wa kutuuzia haki hizo sisi kama vyombo vya habari vya umma kwa bei ambayo tunaweza tukaimudu na la mwisho ni hilo kwamba e, anashukuru anafurahi kukaribishwa aliyopata na hata alipofika kwenye uwanja wa ndege pale ameteremka alipopokelewa vizuri alibaini kwamba kumbe aliyekuwa amekaa naye ndani ya ndege ni meya wa hapa e, Zanzibar na anasema ipo haja ya kuendeleza huo undugu na ushirikiano wa Kiafrika e, kama ambavyo ile spirit ya majumui inapenda kuona na anasema e, anashukuru anawashukuru nini lakini tukimaliza pia mkutano wetu basi tutawaita tena kwa ajili ya kueleza kwamba ni yapi tuliojadili kwa hiyo tunakaribisha maswali e, mtu yote mwenye swali unaweza kuuliza kwa lugha yoyote e, karibuni sana Tiff TV Tiff TV tupo kijamii zaidi